They're gonna find us. Guys, what are we even doing up here? We should just go back. Matt, I'm sorry. My parents are still down there. I'm worried something's gonna happen to my dad. Maybe he can help us. He can't help us, Daryl. He's helping them. What's that supposed to mean? It means he's helping them. You saw him, he just stood there and watched. What else is he supposed to do? Our dad made a choice. And Daryl's dad's gotta make one too, we all do. We're going home. Robert, your parents aren't down there. I saw it. I, I didn't know how to tell you. We can't go home. We can't keep running. What are we supposed to do? I'm gonna fight. I'm gonna fight. Now, this is easier for me because I'm used to it. The rest of you are gonna have a tougher choice. And look, I don't want to sell it to you. It's too ugly for that. And it's ugly and it's hard. But when you're fighting in your own backyard, you're fighting for your family. It all hurts a little less and it makes a little more sense. And for them, this is just some place. But for us, this is our home. Now, obviously, we don't stand a chance against these guys in a straight up fight. But if you look at the Viet Cong or the Mujahideen or even the Minutemen, it's clear. Even the Chinese flea can drive a big dog crazy. So the first thing we have to do is learn how to work together. Become a unit. And that's gonna take some time. It doesn't take much to pull a trigger. But keeping your shit together in a firefight is a whole different story. So we're gonna have to evolve, rewire our reflexes, learn new skills, and adapt old ones. There's almost half a million faces down there and they can't track them all. So we'll find people we can trust, friends with their ears to the ground who can help us get the things we need to fight back. We'll watch what they do. Study their tactics, their routines. The more we know, the easier it will be to hurt them. But we'll need to be smart, and we'll need to be patient. And we'll hit them on our terms, when we're good and ready. We inherited our freedom. Now it's up to all of us to fight for it.